So Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, in order to bring this concept home to us, he said in a hadith narrated by Abu Huraira, "ليس الصيام من الأكل والشرب فقط." Fasting is not merely from eating and drinking. That's a part of it. إنما الصيام من اللغو والرفث. Indeed, fasting is from evil speech. اللغو. And the thoughts that come before it and its effects. Warrafath, corrupt acts in all of their various forms. This is the essence of it. This has to do with our character. How do you judge a person's character? By what he says and what he does. By what he says, or what she says, and what she does. That's your means of judging a person. You say, this is a good character. This person has good manners. Or bad. Based on what they say and what they do. So the Prophet wasallam stressed that the fast is... Over and above giving up food and drink, it is giving up saying bad things. Saying things which are displeasing to Allah and doing bad acts in all of their various forms. And how do we do that? We have to be Conscious of Allah. We have to be conscious of Allah. So the Prophet ﷺ said, فَإِن سَابَكَ أَحَدٌ If anyone curses you while you're fasting, somebody says something hurtful to you, أو جهل عليك or becomes ignorant with you, wants to get into a big argument and this type of thing, فَقُلْ إِنِّي صَائِمٌ Say to that person, I'm fasting. I'm fasting. Remembering the goal of the fast, we don't sink to that person's level and join them in whatever they're saying, whatever they're doing. We just respond saying, I'm fasting. Excuse me. I don't want to get into an argument. I am fasting. I want to preserve my fast. I want to get from my fast what Allah has prescribed for me. So I will not indulge in argumentation with you. 